Noggins, 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 Noggins. We all love Noggins. Good morning. Well, if you're relatively new and you don't get what the hype, this whole noggin hype thing is, well, one, where have you been? And two, the noggins are something that's very important to stuff flying about everywhere. Noggins are something that's very important to the stability of the floor. They keep all the beams straight and they keep the floor more rigid and there's so many to put in because there's so many flaws to put in so instead of thinking this monotonous task that happens all the time we've all convinced ourselves that this is something to celebrate and get excited for noggins What a revelation! So I've been using to drill the beams, if you remember last time, it took me like hours and hours and hours to drill through because the steel is so thick and I've just got like a normal drill. I've been using these little step through things and this is not like an advertisement or anything, but what a game changer! It's done it in like three or four minutes in compared to how long it's taken me. Always learning. So that's two done. I'm going to get the last one done. Then I've got to drill the stone, set the rods, and then I'm going to do a bit of bricking up. Yeah, right. We all know, we all know I should have drilled this before putting the floor on. But, well, the main thing is I was waiting on the drill bits to arrive, so I wanted to crack on. Has made it, well, it's made it a bit more awkward. Um, but they're going in easy enough. It's amazing how dark it is in here now. I just put the last of them floorboards on. Mental, I mean, it is a 
grey day, but still. So, the holes are drilled. Now I'm going to put these threaded bar with a nut and washer on the end. I remembered to put it on first this time. Um, I'm going to resin fix these into the wall. So I'll pump resin in, hammer these in as deep as they go, and then once it's set, do up the bolts nice and tight. Then that is fixed to the wall. Alright, so I was a bit over optimistic about doing the bricking up. It's getting a bit too late now, but all the pins are in for the floor, all the noggins are in. So I've had to put extra noggins on the very outside and that's to take the weight of the roof and that'll make sense kind of in the next few days. So what I thought instead of the bricking up is I can clear off the rest of this wall. Obviously I could only get to half of it until this floor was on and I can have a go at putting some of the steels on the wall just to see how that's gonna work. Hello, Jack P. Hi.
okay so that would be pretty easy actually so this steel is actually going to sit here um, what I'm going to do tomorrow night is smear a load of plaster while I can see the you know get a good level smear it all pretty much level fill all these little bumps in and then once that's dry I'll put like a skim coat of plaster on and I'll just pop this beam on top and that should make the whole perimeter level it'll make more sense when I do it as all these things do but the thing I was worried about is getting these heavy beams onto the wall but with the lift actually super super easy yeah I wish I got more done today but you know that's how it works so tomorrow tomorrow is the official first day of starting the roof structure yeah if you catch it live today thank you for watching there'll be a live again tomorrow I'll try to do one every day if I can um, it's not replacing the videos it's just like a nice little catch up for us during the day different vibe anyway I will see you tomorrow